Suzuki silently drove the Vitara 4 Hybrid into European markets in January 2022. The 2022 Suzuki Vitara Hybrid has entered the Netherlands and Poland and is likely to enter more markets in the coming months. The global partnership between Toyota and Suzuki includes technology transfer for hybrids, although Suzuki seems to have developed a new powertrain for the Vitara. Its range is 100% electrified, with every model featuring some form of electrical assistance and replacing the automatic version of the Vitara Mild Hybrid. For this Vitara Full Hybrid, Suzuki has developed its own setup, combining a new 1.5-litre petrol engine and a 33-brake horsepower electric motor fed by a compact 0.84 kWh battery for a total output of 113 brake horsepower. It's mated to a six-speed automated manual gearbox, which seems an odd choice, and old tech in 2022, but the electric motor's torque is said to sustain forward momentum during gear changes, delve into the numbers, and the Vitara full hybrid's outlook shows some promise. It's priced from £23,499 in SZT trim, and returning acclaimed 53 miles per gallon, and emitting 121 gram per kilometer CO2, its figures aren't stunning, but realistic. The electrification is still milder than some full hybrids, with the setup limited to 140V, whereas petroelectric compact SUV, such as the Toyota Yaris Cross, can muster 580V from its tech. Combined with the small battery, it means the boost you get to reduce the load on the petrol engine is small. It's not fast as a result, with the 0 to 62 miles per hour sprint taking 12.7 seconds, not helped by the transmission's slow changes. The dash design is simple and functional, but could do with a little more flair, it's basically the same as when this fourth generation, Vitara was revealed in 2015, which means the 7-inch, touchscreen infotainment system's graphics and responses could be sharper. All full hybrid Vitara's feature-led headlights, keyless operation, a rear camera, the aforementioned touchscreen with built-in nav, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, 17-inch alloys, climate control, and plenty of safety tech. Stepping up to SZ5 trim adds a panoramic roof, different suede upholstery, plus front and rear parking sensors. While there are hard plastics in prominent places in the cabin, the Vitara feels honest, plus it does represent good value for the level of kit you get. Suzuki is offering a representative PCP deal of £279 a month based on a £5,177 deposit on a 48-month contract limited to 10,000 miles a year. This latest Vitara is also available with the brand's all-grip four-wheel drive system, so there's no loss of choice or off-road ability should you wish to explore the full hybrid route in the range. In the standard driving mode, the electric motor's assistance is noticeable, especially going uphill, but the weak link in the powertrain is the gearbox. The electric motor only just about manages to smooth out shifts, summoning up a burst of torque to keep the Vitara moving forward, and this when cruising lightly. However, the Vitara full hybrid is otherwise solid and secure when it comes to its dynamics. Weighing 1,275 kilograms it's relatively light, and although it feels like an authentic SUV, from behind the wheel, with a raised-up driving position, there's not too much roll. The steering is light and positive enough, like any Vitara, and the car feels fairly agile, together and solid. The ride is acceptable too. You notice big bumps, but aren't shocked drastically by them, while body control is on the softer side, for extra comfort. Thanks for watching and give your comments below.